We are asked to translate the following sentence into an equation and then solve. Jose and Corey are roommates. Together they have 114 books. If Jose has 26 more books than Corey, how many does Corey have? And we're told to use the variable x. And since Jose has 26 more books than Corey, let's let x equal the number of books Corey has. And then since Jose has 26 more books than Corey, we can use the expression x plus 26 to represent the number of books Jose has. Now we know together they have 114 books, which means x plus the quantity x plus 26 must equal 114. And now if we solve the equation for x, we can determine the number of books that Corey has and then once we have x, we can determine the number of books that Jose has, which is x plus 26. The first step in solving the equation is to simplify the left side. x plus x plus 26 simplifies to 2x plus 26, since x and x are like terms. The next step is to add or subtract to isolate the variable term. To undo the plus 26, we subtract 26 on both sides. Simplifying. On the left, 26 minus 26 is equal to zero, which is why we subtracted 26 on both sides. The left side simplifies to 2x. 2x is equal to 114 minus 26, which is equal to 88. The last step is to multiply or divide in order to solve for the variable. And since 2x means two times x, to undo the multiplication and solve for x, we divide both sides by two. Simplifying, two divided by two simplifies to one. One times x is x. x is equal to 88 divided by two, which is equal to 44. And since x is the number of books Corey has, we know Corey has 44 books. And now for the number of books that Jose has, remember, the number of books Jose has is equal to x plus 26. So for the expression x plus 26, we substitute 44 for x, which gives us 44 plus 26, which is equal to 70. Jose has 70 books. And notice how 44 plus 70 is equal to 114. I hope you found this helpful.